Vanessa is a very interesting day. Um, first of all, I want to congratulate Vanessa on finishing your speech. Finally, where are you? <laughs> <I'm so laughs> um, the topic Vanessa um, talked about today is how to live a better life. There are many books, much information talk about this topic, but instead of quoting from others, she just concluded her own version about this topic. And three tips. The first one is about time management and wake up at a reasonable hour. And, and then we can have a fresh beginning of the day. The second tip is to think about something you can look forward to. It means that if we set some goals in our daily life, there will motivations to push us ahead. And last but not least, take good care of yourself and stay healthy. And of course, health is the basic of everyone. So it is important to take good care of ourselves. And Vanessa's speech was really convincing to me because um, she is a busy college student. She has many activities, many things to deal with. And as my junior, a sophomore in law department, she, um, her Study loading is really heavy, so but she can still arrange her time well. Um, so I think you are appropriate to talk about this topic. <coughs> um, first is about the advantages of your speech. Um, the structure is really good, and you really meet with the requirement of C2. Strong opening, tips on how to live a better life, and first of all, second, and strong conclusion. Should review the tips she mentioned. Um, the clear outline makes your listeners understand the messages you want to convey easily. And she made many comparisons as examples in her speech. Like, um, she used to feel hasty in the past, in the morning, but now she works out earlier. She used to consider life to be boring and tedious, but now she sets some goals to add colors in daily life. And the topic you choose is really common, close to, close to our daily life. This is a good point. And um, as your evaluator, I have some suggestions to you. Um, first of all, it's about the eye contact. Your eye contact is, we, we don't know where you are looking at. You just look around, look around. And my advice to you is that you can find some focus to focus on. Like um, this here, you can look at a chair's back. And here you can find your evaluator to look at. And here you can look at the back of the room. Yeah. And you can have some eye contact with the audience. People won't think you are nervous. And the next problem is about PVT. Maybe it certainly provides you with a sense of security, but it restrains you to stand on this, um, to stand on the area of the stage. Um, maybe the next time you can try not to use it. Just slow down the tempo of your speech and say out loud and clearly. Don't worry, you won't forget the script. Yeah, you have practiced many times, I know. And oh yeah, Vanessa, you are so cute. And the performance in your beginning is really good. I congratulate again. Back to you.